I'm back with another recipe here for you guys. Very easy to make, really delicious, and it goes with almost everything. It's my rice with corn, and I'll list all the ingredients in, down in the description box. I'm gonna start by heating up some olive oil. Once the oil is a little bit hot, I'll add in my chopped shallots with cilantro. You just want to cook down the veggies until they're nice and transparent. I'm adding in my corn. I always drain the liquid of the canned corn. I'll add the liquid in later, but I want the corn to take in all the flavor of the veggies. And now I'm going to add about one teaspoon of the powdered chicken broth of Maggie. That's the brand that I like to use. And in this recipe, I'm making four cups of rice, so I'm going to do five cups of water. And I'm going to add the sazon goya for color and a little bit of flavor. I'm gonna stir that up. I'm gonna let, let the water come into boiling. Once it's boiling, I'm gonna add the white long rain rice that I use, and it's washed. I only wash it once just to remove some of the starch. I just find that it makes my rice separate more and be fluffy. At this point, I'm going to taste my broth and I'm going to add a little bit more salt. Always, always taste your food along the way. You don't want to cook this rice and then find out that it was bland. So I'll add just a little bit more salt and then I'll let the pot boil until the rice absorbs some of the water. Now the rice has absorbed about 80% of the water, I'm going to give it another stir and then I'm going to cover my, pa my pan and set the setting to lower heat on my stove, it's a number 3, and I'm going to let it cook down for approximately 20 minutes. now 20 minutes later and my rice is done I can tell by just looking at it and I'm gonna give it one final stir and turn the heat off and then I just usually put the lid back on and let the rice rest before I serve it And today, this is going to be served with some ground beef with potatoes. My kids like to eat the beef with their taco shells, but I like to enjoy it just with this wonderful rice. And it really does complement itself so well. I can't tell you how much I enjoy making this dish and enjoyed eating it. So thank you again. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It will help me a lot.